हेलो एवरीवन जय हिंद जय भारत जय माता दी दिस इज वन ऑफ द लेटेस्ट वीडियो एवर इन टर्म्स ऑफ आईएमयू आईएमयू फॉर्म्स आर आउट फॉर 2024 एंड 25 बैच सो व्हाट आर द लेटेस्ट अपडेट्स देयर इज लॉट्स ऑफ डाउट्स रिगार्डिंग एनआईओएस कि मैं एलिजिबल हूं कि नहीं कंपार्टमेंट लग गई है क्या करूं मैं एलिजिबल हो पाऊंगा कि नहीं uh, मैंने तो 2023 में दे रखा है आईएमयू सीईटी बट रैंक मेरी अच्छी नहीं आई है मैं क्या करूं इस साल या फिर मेरी रैंक है बट मैं एडमिशन नहीं ले पाया था पिछले साल तो इस साल मैं उस रैंक पे ले पाऊंगा कि नहीं एवरीथिंग इज मेंशन हियर आपको क्या करना है डाउनलोड यू हैव यू जस्ट हैव टू डाउनलोड दिस प्रोस्पेक्टस यू नीड टू गो थ्रू आईएमयू वेबसाइट देयर ऑफिशियल वेबसाइट इज मेंशन इन द लिंक इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स आल्सो एंड दैट इज imu.edu.in सो वहां पे जाओ आप जस्ट गो थ्रू क्लिक ऑन गो टू होम पेज एंड देन आफ्टर क्लिक ऑन एडमिशन एडमिशन देन आफ्टर एडमिशन एंड साइड में आएगा एक कॉलम दैट इज कॉल्ड अप्लाई नाउ बटन एंड देन आफ्टर यू विल गेट द पेज एंड जस्ट ऑन लेफ्ट साइड यू नीड टू क्लिक डाउनलोड प्रोस्पेक्टस सो दिस इज द प्रोस्पेक्टस हमने ओपन कर रखा है कम टू द थर्ड दिया दिस वन थर्ड पेज वेयर एवरीथिंग इज मेंशन जस्ट क्लिक इट हियर यू विल गेट बैक टू दैट पेज यू विल गेट टू दैट पेज इटसेल्फ देन आफ्टर Here everything mentioned, admission process सबको पता ही होगा Just come to the bullet points. So just come on the 15th chapter that is qualifying examination for admission to UG UG programs. So NIOS के बच्चे eligible हैं कि नहीं So the final examination of 10 plus 2 systems conducted by a NIOS recognized central state board such as CBSE, ICSE and NIOS etc are eligible. Here no other open board is mentioned. Here only mention. Here they have only mention in IOS. So in IOS students are eligible, but there is a clause. Wait. So intermediate. Next point: intermediate or two-year pre-university PUC Maharashtra University students for you people. Intermediate or two-year pre-university. examination conducted by a recognized board or university they are also eligible what is the eligibility criteria that is 60% pcm and 50% in english okay come to the note point what i have informed you about the clause that is mentioned here in note third that is improvement candidates that is those who had secured less than 60% you have given already you have given your exam in cbse board and you achieved minimum uh, you have achieved 59% or let's say 58% in pcm what you have to do so overall in physics chemistry and math in class 12th examination which uh, which marks i am telling which uh, less than pcm less than pcm means physics chemistry math aggregate marks of these subjects only so out of that if you have not achieved what you have to do see had taken the exam in exam again in order to improve the you need to improve your marks always march in avt college team is telling pranit sir is telling improve your marks improve, improve your marks improve your marks then come improve your marks then come or compartmental candidates those who have failed who had failed in one or more subjects in class 12 examination and had appeared in the examination again and passed means you again came to your board means you got failed in one or two subjects let's consider you have taken five subjects in your 12th physics chemistry math english and one more let's consider physical education so in these five you got failed in physics and english consider it so you you are eligible for giving the compartment exam i think you know you people know if you got fail in three exams you need to reappear again For next year, you are not a compartmental student. Okay, if you failed in two subjects only, you are able to give compartment exam. So just go for your compartment exam, improve your marks. Then also you are eligible. If one more, if he is here, what it, what is it? So failed in one or more subjects in class twelve exam and had appeared in the examination again. Again you got, uh, you are appeared in compartmental exam conducted by the same board. means you got fail in cbse so you you have to give compartment exam in, again in cbse itself you will give cbse on, only but if you are going for other board for improving your marks then you are not uh, eligible for that 
what they have mentioned subject to conditions such that improvement compartmental candidates should have reappeared in the examination conducted by the same board whatever the exam you are going for for your improve for your improving your marks or for your just going for your passing your marks you need to go through the same board itself if you are changing it from cbse to nios then you are not eligible if you are a student of nios board only then you are eligible but if you switch it from cbse to nios then you are not eligible it is mentioned here then after then after i need to show you one more thing page number 33 of this prospectus just go through that and check out your city is mentioned here or not because these are the imu centers which are going to conduct on 86 2024 so be ready with your preparations and just go to the centers and give your exam then one more thing i would like to inform you people that negative marking will be followed so negative marking is also there if you don't know the answer don't just leave it don't go and just um, attempt it for otherwise you will lose your 0.25 marks what you have achieved like if you have achieved one marks in one question so if you select one wrong answer so you achieved only 0.75 marks only okay so be ready with this also then after there is no imu cet in terms of december batch so just you need to get a good rank in this you need to get a good rank in this imu cet only in august i am sorry in june what the imu cet is going to held in june in that only you have to do rock otherwise you are not again you need to go for 225 imu cet which is going to held in uh, june itself so that time you need to give your best otherwise there is only one chance for this year that is there is a no that is june uh, june imu cet and no imu cet is there in december batch okay then after candidate desirous of taking admission to imu program through any other eligible course or through imu cet rank of year 2023 need not register in uh, imu cet 2025 24 portal so if you have achieved a good rank in imu cet 2023 exam and you want to take admission on that rank basis you are able to get admission and if you have already appeared in 2023 but not got a good rank you have not achieved a good rank you are not well prepared about that so you need to reappear again you have a chance to improve your rank and secure a good seat so you need to achieve a good rank here you need to crack this exam properly need to try to get a good rank try to get air1 imu cet those who are waiting to become just comment it below that i will become air1 and these are the interesting information from this if more information if you would like to get more information from here just comment it below about the questions we'll make a video and we'll update we'll update it very soon jai hind jai bharat jai mata